Well, hello and welcome to our live coverage on what is, of course, a very big day on the American continent. It is the opening day of this great competition, the great party featuring 12 nations, and the turnout reflects the significance. The atmosphere, a real treat for those who are part of it. It is indeed special. Entirely unique. This place has something special about it. Our Bombonera. Everybody standing for the national anthem of Costa Rica. National Anthem of Chile. Strong start, essential for both teams here as they look to head towards the knockout stage. Yes, and that's very apparent, Peter. Competition football is a different beast entirely. And you have to be prepared to dig deep to prevent everything going south very quickly. So this could be a, a tentative standoff in weighing each other up. I hope we'll see more probing than possession. got things on the way Jim which player is best equipped for this game yeah Keylor Navas he could make all the difference because he's such an excellent shot stopper it's not just a matter of reflexes though it's the way he spreads his body in front of the ball preventing strikers from getting a sighted goal he also hardly ever makes an error and that's precious for a goalkeeper yeah I'm inclined to agree Walter, Brian Ruiz, and the ball is out of play. Just brushed off the ball there. Rolando, Campbell. Costa Rica, disappointing in the end there. They lack urgency. And it's Sanchez. Vidal. Valdez. Vidal. Navarro. Oh, good interception. And now the breakaway. Plays it out wide. Here it comes. Got a crucial block in there. Brian Ruiz is short. Header! Zamorano. Valdez. Anything noteworthy in the early part of the match, Jim? Arevalo. Navarro. Sanchez looks to dink one in. Knocks it away. Shapes to shoot. Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. 
Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Walter tries to get it forward quickly. No change to the score. Nil-nil it remains. That intervention was very necessary. Valdez. Forward it goes. Played out to the right. Looking for space out wide. And the counter is on. Face to face with the keeper. And that has been clubbed away. And it's been taken straight back. Quintero. Keeper goes long. Zamorano. Aimed long and direct. Zamorano. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. And he just whacks it away. He's going to be pulled back for that one. Alexis Sanchez. Big chance! Big relief. It just needed better contact. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. to intervene Valdez Vidal back into the middle fires it in low Campbell Walter Rolando Played into space out wide. Danger averted for now. Forward it goes. Salas. Pinged one through here. Shoots! And he's there to make a great save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Played it short, and he's whipped it in low, and he's there to hoof it away. Samorano! A oh, great save, real class. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Costa Rica can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. Rolando, and he's made certain that won't get through. Campbell, lovely feet, tosses in a low one, cleared without complication, it's the through ball, yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves, Chile seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle, that was easily read and dealt with. Look, there are always tactical adjustments for any coach to make at half-time, but when your star man gives you a critical lead just before the break, everyone will be paying extra attention. It really is the ideal tonic. Ah, oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion.
actually get themselves into the lead. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. He's got away. Now it's Campbell. He's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Well, there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Chile haven't played that badly. Getting caught again on the counter-attack is unlikely. They're switched on to that, and still very much in this game. Chile go in at half-time with a slender one-goal lead. So, off we go once more. Chile really need to go and, and grab another goal now, Peter, if they're going to go on and secure this. ball clears it out of harm's way Vidal Oviedo plays it forward tried to play it through yeah the idea was right the delivery wasn't they can revisit that further on Brian Ruiz. That's a decent ball. Beautifully done. Drills one in. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. The ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Who's getting there? The question, that's a foul. Fence has got rid of that. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach and it may just freshen things up. Now it's Sanchez. Navarro. Tries to get it forward quickly. The clearance and very necessary. Can he finish? It didn't come off, but an audacious effort. Well, it was certainly an acrobatic effort. I mean, it was probably the best option for him, but they're never easy to pull off. It's got through. More than, yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Oh! 
of true class. Costa Rica are back in business. Oh, that is a bit special. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well-matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Tries to think it in. Aimed long and direct. Could move up a gear here. Now it's Ruiz. Going for goal! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Out wide to the right. Cut out in the nick of time. Tries lifting it over. It's the through ball. Boots it to safety. Paid to a promising move. Valdez! He's done very well to get to that. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. And it's been taken short. Played into the middle. And he just whacks it away. Campbell. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Salas. You would think the first substitutions will be coming up pretty soon. Locks it away. Orlando. This could be a Costa Rican counter-attack. That's a decent ball. Going through. Striding forward, facing goal. And he heaves it forward. Now surely. That's gone a long way up and away. Gets it back all the way back and they start again Lopez Flores forward it goes now it's Ruiz and the balls come loose and the chase is on Oviedo so who's he picking at looking to shoot Goal at his mercy, and somehow he's missed it. Well, maybe the tension around this game played a part in that, because he should have put them ahead then. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Zamorano. Ezekiel. Lobs it in gently. Looking for a corner. Vidal plays it short. Look, this could still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Oh, he's caught it there, it's a free kick. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. 
Played back in. Now it's Campbell. It's got through to him. Oh, and he's got good distance. Who's chasing? Great strength. Too strong for his opponent. He's gone for it! All over in seconds. That's what they can do to you. Yes, the turn and finish is to be admired, but what about the sense of urgency and desire to move the ball with such pace on the break as soon as it was retrieved? His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. lead now it's just a question of holding on well look Peter I feel I've got to stress that there's still time for another so we can't be too presumptuous yet Brian Ruiz look with time running out they have to get the ball in the penalty box and if it means a long punt then so be it they've got to give themselves a chance Two minutes to be added on. It is just a question of running down the clock now. There's only one word for this. It, it's baffling. That team needs to figure out where the ball needs to be, and it's not there. And that is that. Chile starts as they wanted to start. All three points. The first three points, crucially. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, they've laid down a marker with such a good opening win, and they're saying to the rest of the group, we're intent on staying at the top. On this evidence, I think there's every chance too.